I'm going to make sesame toffee or thala aluwa. For this recipe, I'm using 100 and 450 grams of brown sugar and two cardamom pods. I crushed the seeds, then vanilla and 250 grams of sesame seeds. I roasted it until it's brown. Then I have 400 grams of rice flour, but you won't need this much of rice flour, but it's handy to have it in hand. Sometimes when you are doing aluwa, you need extra flour always. So I'm using quarter a cup of water with the sugar. To start this, I'm going to add the water into a pan with the 450 grams of brown sugar and I'm going to melt this on the stove into that I'm going to add a teaspoon of vanilla and the cardamom seeds I crushed I'm going to boil it once the sugar start boiling I took it out now I'm going to add the sesame seeds into the sugar and mix it and leave it to cool down a bit before adding the rice flour if you add the rice flour into the hot sugar it will cook the rice flour then what we are going to expect expect from um, this uh, kind of a toffee so I'm going to leave it a bit to cool down before I add the rice flour once the sugar mix is cold enough to handle I'm going to add the rice flour a little by little and mix it well. Once it comes to the the point that you can't mix anymore, put that onto the prepared board. It's really you have to be very quick to do this and just press it down. Take ev everything from the spoon and press it down from you can use a banana leaf or a baking paper or some other kind of uh, non-stick paper. Just spread a little bit of flour on top too. Just press it down. Make it a square then you won't waste anything. If you make it a circle the waste is little higher than the, the square. So just press it down and leave it to cool down about half an hour before cutting it into pieces. This is one of my mom's favorite recipe that she used to make it all the time and we love to eat it when we were kids so I think the taste will be the same. I'm going to leave it about half an hour. Now the sesame toffee or talalua is ready and they are really nice. And I cut it into um, nearly 25-30 pieces and and I didn't use the whole lot of roasted rice flour when you make aloo or anything that you have to have some extra in hand so that's why maybe a 50 nearly 50 grams left and this is tala aloo or sesame toffee and I hope you will enjoy this too thank you for watching